Okay, today is my English Chef for TOEFL 2019, October 19th. Uh, today, I took the TOEFL test, the real TOEFL test. It's, I think it's not, I'm not sure it's not, uh, it's gonna be a final, but I, this is my first time of my taking TOEFL, and I t it took, it took more than three hour, uh, words, and yeah, first I wanna say, I think I did a good job. Yeah, I prepared well. I prepared well, and I, I did what I can do, whatever I can do for the test. Yeah, I'm not so um, satisfied with uh, in the grade. You mean the grade is not shown or displayed yet? It's gonna be ten days later, and I think, so, yeah, there is a lot of question that I couldn't solve, and. What I'm very frustrated is, you mean I'm very so frustrated about listening because I could, you mean I was able to solve those questions, but I couldn't because of the exhaustion. So when when I I feel very uh, frustrated when I when I was not able to uh, when I was not able to solve the question, even if I. If I am, if I was capable to do that, the reading it was yeah. I think my score, the worst score is is reading, but I'm not so uh, frustrated or uh, regret about it because I know my skill, my reading skill is not good. So I think I really did well about reading. But as for listening, I could better, much better than that I thought. Yeah, but uh, but. I don't want to hurt myself because this is because because of the exhaustion or awareness. Yeah, I was really exhausted or become tired because of the reading and after that there are long uh, listening sections. So I was really I feel really tired and my concentration became worse. So it was very difficult for me to answer. Yeah, I have a lot of regret, but. And I'm really so frustrated about listening, but I think I recovered I a lot of things in speaking and writing because I had a little bit rest time in the uh, between the listening and writing, uh, speaking, and yeah, even in the speaking I did some mistakes, but I think I recovered it, and uh, yeah, there there is some like as a. And looking at whole section, I did a lot of or some mistakes or um, yeah, overlook something. But even though I didn't become panic or I didn't become or I didn't give up, that I think that's the best thing in this uh, this TOEFL test. Yeah, I recovered. I tried to recover, and I think some of them I could. I was able to recover. And that was a really great, great, great experience in my achievement of the TOEFL. I'm not sure what my grade is. I think I, I hope and I was able to. I think I was able to. I'm able to. I can reach more than 80, but I'm not sure that I can get more than 85. Yeah, I hope that I wanted. Yeah, I hope to have more than 90, but I, it seems it's really difficult for me to have more than 90. Yeah, if I did well in listening, it was a little bit able to possible more than to take more than 90, but yeah, I think it's difficult. Yeah, in my assumption, my assumption is yeah, 86 or around 86, 7, 8, yeah. Anyway, I did my good job, and I want to uh, acclaim myself and praise and acclaim myself. It wasn't the worst. It's not a best, but I think it was not a worst. And I stopped to become a worst, and that's a really, really great achievement and feat in this time. Yeah, I will. I, I really want to play praise about that. Yeah, really good job. Yeah. And thank you for watching today. See you.